Hello everyone. Welcome to the video on concept explanation of heat sterilization process and certain values like D value, Z value, F value. In the recently conducted Telangana State Public Service Commission Drug Inspector Examination, there is a question related to these values. First look at the question. Now, which of the following is a measure of total lethality of heat sterilization process for a particular microorganism, which is also used to measure the lethality of different heat sterilization processes? Let us understand the question. The question is about there is a particular value which measures the total lethality of heat sterilization process. Total lethality means complete death of microorganisms. So by applying heat, heat sterilization process, complete death of microorganisms will occur. And the same value is used to compare the measure of lethality of different sterilization process. See, heat sterilization process, we have moist heat sterilization and dry heat sterilization process are there. The efficiency of these process is measured by a particular value. The question is about that value. What is that value? Is Options given are Z value, D value, F value and H value. Now, before getting into that, let us understand the heat sterilization process and what happens with the microorganism death rate. When heat is applied, microorganisms will die. So the more amount of heat is applied or higher temperatures are applied, the sooner microorganisms will die. That means the time taken to cause the death of microorganism is inversely proportional to the temperature. Let us put it in uh, uh, numbers. If you, if you apply 200 degrees centigrade, microorganisms will die in 10 minutes. If you apply 100 degrees centigrade, microorganisms will die in 20 or 30 minutes. So there is an inverse relationship is there. This is called as thermal death time. Time required to kill microorganisms when thermal heat is applied. So this is called as TDT. There is a question about this also in, in drug inspector exam only. They asked what do you, what is stands by TDT, thermal death time. Now, so uh, let us plot a curve between microorganisms on Y axis and the time taken to kill them in X axis. Time is on X axis, microorganism number in on Y axis. Look at the curve. So when you apply constant temperature, as the time passes, microorganisms will die. You get this kind of curve. Now convert this curve into log curve, you get a straight line. Now, now let us understand the following curve. Now imagine you have 10 to the power of 5 organisms are there. That means 1 lakh bacteria are there. So by applying or, or increasing by applying heat, the organism number will fall down. Now from 1 lakh to 10,000, that means a 90% drop. 1 lakh to 10,000 means 90,000 microorganisms are died. 90,000 is 90% 90 of 1 lakh. So from 1 lakh, 90% drop occurred and the organisms come down to 10 to the power of 4, that is 10,000. Now that corresponding time, look at this, from 20 to 25 minutes, that means it took 5 minutes, it took 5 minutes to kill 90,000 organisms. That means to convert 1 lakh organism to 1,000 organisms. And this particular time is known as D value. So D value is the time taken to reduce 90% of microorganisms from 1 lakh to 10,000. 90,000 organisms died. So 90% reduction, that is D value. So D value is related to time, but our question is related to total lethality. So D value is not the answer. Now let us see Z value. Again, look at the graph. On the Y axis, D values are taken. On the X axis, temperature is taken. Now look at the point A to B. Point A to B, the D value at A is 100, at B it is 10. So D value is reduced 10 times. Now look at the corresponding temperatures. So the raise in temperatures which causes 10% reduction in D value is called as Z value. So it is about temperature. Now our question is about total lethality, not about temperature. So Z value is, not, is also not the correct answer. Now look at the F value. F value indicates the temperature required to kill complete kill of organisms. This relates to total lethality. So the question total lethality is about F value. The answer here is F value. So this is what is tested in uh, drug inspector examination. I hope this concept uh, is useful. Thank you for watching this video.